Introducing the Zicky Shell command. It brings hundreds of revolutionary features right to your current favorite shell. Features like filtering and expanding. Let's say you're in a standard bash shell. Want to filter the output of the ls command? Type Zicky Shell ls. Then type any string to incrementally filter down. Then type Control Q and you're right back in bash. Want to easily navigate files? Type Zicky Shell ls, filter down if you want, and use the arrow keys to move around. Then expand and collapse directories by typing Control Enter. Similar to how you navigate files in a graphical file browser. Then type Control Q and you're back in bash in the directory you just navigated to. Bash, Z Shell, and other shells are pretty awesome. Now you can use them most of the time and jump in and out of Zicky when you feel like you need Zicky features. Just like how shell users jump in and out of less. Type Zicky shell before a command whenever you want to filter and expand, like ps to quickly kill processes and git to easily navigate your git history. When you expand a command, Zicky does the thing that intuitively makes sense. Because of features like these, the author of O'Reilly's Linux cookbook calls Zicky revolutionary and the next big thing in free and open source software. Zicky Shell has hundreds of intuitive options. Type Zicky Shell N to search file names starting in the current directory. You can always type Control Enter to edit a file in place, or Control D for a drop down menu with many useful options. Type Zicky Shell S to search file contents and filter down further. Type Zicky Shell L to list and rerun commands from your history. Dash F for commands you've marked as favorites and dash E to browse and run common examples. The dash means to run a Zicky command, and there are hundreds of useful Zicky commands. Type Zicky shell dash HTML to try out some HTML, dash CSS to apply some CSS, and dash JS to run some JavaScript. Type Zicky shell dash tables to navigate and update database tables. Pass SQL directly to Zicky shell to run it. Then you can edit the output and type control enter to save. Zicky has commands for interacting with all kinds of libraries and tools. Type Zicky shell dash bootstrap to quickly make bootstrap pages. Use a caret to browse and update notes with runnable code examples. Type Zicky shell dash dom to browse and update the dom. Or pass a specific dom ID to Zicky shell. The coolest part of Zicky is that it's trivially easy to create your own commands. Create shell commands with plus plus. Just edit and save the shell command. Zicky puts it in the right place and takes care of everything else. Create Zicky commands with a single plus. It starts you off with a couple sample menu items. It's just a plain text file, so you can edit and add new items. Save the file and then run it using a dash. Commands you create are just text files saved in the commands directory and your home directory. Add an extension like rbpy or js to make a command in a programming language. Use three pluses to make a shell command wrapper so you can expand that command's output. Here's using the foo command we just created in the web browser in the Zicky web interface. Here's creating a command in the web browser. Just like a wiki, you go to a URL that doesn't exist yet to create a command and running it from the command line. You can run the command in your text editor as well if it has a Zicky plugin installed and even optionally use the mouse Zicky comes with hundreds of commands, but the creation of new commands is just beginning. Create a command for your favorite tool or API, like these commands that let you tweet, view Twitter followers, and send text messages with Twilio by passing a phone number to Zicky Shell. See the other videos on the Zicky Kickstarter page for demos of these things. Back the Zicky Kickstarter and help me bring the next version of Zicky to the world. If it doesn't pass, I'll keep working on Zicky, but if the Kickstarter succeeds, I'll be able to focus on things like refining and releasing Zicky Shell, improving the installer and the initial user experience, and helping in pair programming with people who are new to Zicky, as well as support for more text editors like Vim and Sublime, help shape the future of technology toward openness and flexibility. Back the Zicky Kickstarter today.